Good morning, SK. Good morning, SK. Welcome back, SK. Good morning, South. Good morning, SK, and welcome to one of the few normal days this week. What do you mean by that? Tomorrow is testing day with, that we all wish was in May this year. Isn't that when we sit in a room for hours taking just one test? <laughs> yep, sure is. Good morning, Wolves. Mrs. Duchesne here, reminding you about our school-wide testing day tomorrow. SKHS will be on an altered testing schedule, and all students on campus will be testing. Just a reminder of what to bring. A fully charged Chromebook. Freshmen also bring a set of headphones. Bring at least two number two pencils with erasers, picture ID, water bottle, and a snack for break time, and an approved calculator. Seniors, you can check out a graphing calculator from your math teacher today or the book room today. Sophomores and juniors, you can check out a scientific calculator from the book room today. Freshmen, you do not need to bring a calculator on test day. Remember, students must turn off all electronic devices upon entering the testing room and will not be allowed to access electronics, bags, or backpacks at all during testing, even during your breaks. You all should have received a testing slip this morning with your testing location. Please report to your testing room at 745 or as soon as you arrive to school. It's still a late start day, but the sooner you can arrive to your testing room, the better. Since this day will be dedicated to you and your future after SK, please dress up in your favorite college or career attire. Remember, a good night's sleep and a healthy breakfast will help your scores tremendously. Go Wolves! Tomorrow you have to be in your testing room first thing in the morning. Hey, have you thought about where you're going after high school? If you're not sure yet, colleges will be visiting the Career Center this week. St. Martin's University will be visiting this afternoon. Thursday has Oregon Institute of Universe Technology visiting in the morning, and University of Alaska Fairbanks will be visiting in the afternoon. Western Oregon University will be meeting Friday afternoon. Steering away from testing tomorrow, are you a fan of 90s pop culture? Have you ever played Dungeons and Dragons? Maybe you're in the mood for monsters and awesome battle scenes? Well, the fall play, She Kills Monsters, will open November 5th, and tickets will range from 2 to $5. SK DECA will be attending the Fall Leadership Conference in November. If you're a member and are interested in going, see Ms. Fighter in room 261 for the paperwork. Permission slips, payments, and the DECA code of conduct are due today after school. In club news, French meets today. Tomorrow, international, SK eSports, Spanish, speech and debate, and GSA. Thursday, clubs are Adoptees United, Art, Ceramics, DECA, FCCLA, Green Team, Japanese, Skills USA Math, STEM, and Yearbook. In sports, Varsity Volleyball lost 3-1 against Rogers, but played one of the best games this season. Ashland Potts had 12 assists, 13 digs, and 5 kills, and Anna Harvey, 6 kills and 4 blocks. JV lost 2-1, and C-Team won 3-0. Varsity and C-Team football both sadly lost to Emerald Ridge, Varsity 51-0 and C-Team 34-18. Well, that's all the news for today. Yes, and remember, after testing day, Thursday will be an A-Day. Roll the scroll!